Williams with Auto Custom Carpets, and today we've got a 1990 Dodge Ram truck that we're going to install our vinyl flooring in. We've got a couple of ACC employees that's going to do the install for us. So let's get started. As with any ACC flooring product, you should get it out of the box as soon as you can. Due to the nature of vinyl products, the optimal working temperature is around 70 degrees. Too warm, and the product becomes over flexible. Too cold, and the vinyl material will become overly stiff. Be sure to lay the product out on the floor and pop the contours back in place the best you can. Now we will start by removing the seat, which was held in place by four nuts located under the cab of the truck. Next, we will proceed to remove the door seals, kick panels, and tool tray located behind the seat. After removing the seat belts, we then remove the rubber boot and bracket from around the gear shift. Now it is time to take out the old carpet and vacuum the floor pan to remove any loose debris. If the original carpet included padding, then the ACC replacement vinyl flooring should also include padding, which is shipped loose in the box. Install the padding first by spraying a light adhesive to hold the padding in place while the vinyl flooring is being installed. Now it is time to get the new vinyl flooring installed in the truck. Like most of our flooring products, you will need to trim material off all four sides to achieve a perfect fit. For this reason, we never recommend starting at the firewall. Always start by finding contours in the floor pan, such as the transmission tunnel and seat risers, and use those points to match up with the same contours in the vinyl flooring. During the install process, Always reference back to these points to ensure you maintain good positioning. As we work forward and get to the gear shift, we will cut a small X or hole at the base of the shifter that will allow it to go through the flooring. We start with only a small hole. We can increase the size of the hole later as needed. Next, we will work on getting the vinyl flooring fitting correctly at the firewall by trimming excess material off as needed. It is important to take your time here. Trim a little off and check the fit. Trim more where needed. Once 
Once the firewall is trimmed correctly, we move on to trimming the sides and rear, which is a pretty simple process. After the vinyl flooring is trimmed and fitting correctly on all four sides, we can move on to cutting the holes for the seat bolts and seat belts. Then replace the door seals and tool tray. We now can cut some extra material out from around the gear shifter and replace the bracket and rubber boot. We will finish up this project by reinstalling the seat. Here are some before and after photos. If you're tired of ruining your carpet, then the ACC vinyl flooring is the perfect alternative. Just be sure to accept nothing less than ACC products which are proudly made in the USA.